Tombstone is the is, is almost the movie soundtrack song on this album. Bit of a different song for us, I reckon. It's pretty sort of, um, you know, poppy by our kind of standard, I guess. It, I kind of you hear it kind of like um, Sweet Emotion by Aerosmith. I reckon it's just a well-written song. Brad sounded really good with it. It's hard to explain. You need, you need to have different flavours on an album. You know, if people are going to listen to for 40 minutes. 45 minutes of music, they want to hear different things. We wrote, we recorded this song um, ages and ages ago, and then uh, when Brendan joined, he redid some of the guitar parts, and that's when the song really took off. And I think it's, it's probably the only song on the album where I don't actually play any chords, it's all like um, sort of melodic lines, like all through the chorus and everything. I'm really proud of how it came out in the end, but it was one of those songs that. You know, you bring the band practice and people go, ah, oh, it's alright. You go, fuck, really? I thought it was fucking awesome, man. Like, and, uh, you know, so you go back home and rewrite it, and sooner or later it just clicks with everybody, and it's something magical. It's a lot of times with a song that you're on an album, it wasn't written that way first up. It might have been two years earlier that they wrote it, and it could have been totally different. It could have been a reggae song or whatever, and then they they don't like it or they change it or they re change bits and eventually turns out with the product that's on the album and that's what they're happy with but it always starts, it usually starts a lot different and this is one of those songs started out um, more cruisy and all really kind of steady and then it just became kind of an anthem. Hayden made some mega parts of this and I reckon you know, people don't give the bass guitarist enough credit sometimes, but this song really is, is fucking rad. Those runs he does in the, in the verse and at the end, it's, it really picks up to another level because of those bass lines. So, uh, well done, two dogs.